Okay, here he comes. Gotcha, sucker. <laughs>
tough son of a bitch, man. Of course it has to get dark on us. <laughs> One thirty five. Nice. Get out of here, Pego. All right, I got two Alpha T Rex teeth, teeth in the the trophy, and two points for the bird. And 51 rune stones. That's 37 levels for my bat. Nice. <laughs> 37 levels. That's awesome. Uh, what do I want to put on Grayla here? Probably just melee damage. Maybe a little. Actually, I think I'm going to give her a little more stamina. That was a pretty long fight. Alright, let's see if we got any loot. Oh yeah, wine's got a really nice. Oh, unless that's already stuff that you had. She has a mastercraft crossbow and an ascendant crossbow. Yeah, those were my crossbows. Oh, you already had those? Okay. Yeah. Um. Let's see if Vampira has anything. She's kind of bloody. Grayla got final kills, so she should have got loot, right? She's got the artifacts, but she doesn't have any actual loot. There we go. Oh, yeah, my bat got the crap beat out of it. And no points either. Really? That's weird. I'm surprised it didn't get any points out of that. That doesn't make sense. How could the bat not get any points? It's not done leveling. Is there a limit as to how many critters get the XP? Not that I know of. That is weird. It has a trike bone helmet skin. I don't know why it would have that. Oh no, that's my inventory. Yeah, I got the trike bone helmet skin too. You get that from killing a Rex? Apparently, because I didn't have it before that Rex. <laughs> That's weird. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why the why Vampire didn't get any points. My Argies did. And I did. I, got one I point. didn't get any points. Really? So I wonder, if, I wonder if we were at some kind of a max limit. And so two... I think my bat hogged all the points. If it got that many, yeah. Of course, your bat is... Is the newest of all the creatures, though, is the thing, so. Or a charge station. A charge station? What do you charge? So you get batteries. The way Aberration is, is like, if it's dark out, like, there's nameless that come out of the ground and attack you. Nameless? Called, yeah, they're called Nameless, and they just constantly come out of the ground. Oh, I want that Ravager. Where's the Ravager? Over here. You see where I'm at? Yeah. You see those? You see that hyena looking? Oh, at? yeah. They're amazing pack creatures. Uh, they're amazing what creatures? Pack creatures, like if you have multiple of them. Oh, pack, yeah. Um, how, well, how deep does this cave go? I don't think it's too deep. Well, I'm recording, so let's just look at it, and then if you want to try and tame that, we can. Does it require anything special? Uh, cook. I tame them with a uh, cooked uh, mutton. Oh, there's more down here. Oh, there's a uh, an artifact too. 
Oh, there's a 150 male too. And a 140 female. Can you pick those up and carry them into a pit, into a, a taming pin? Um, the way I do it is I drag them out to my RG, and then I pick them up with my RG and drop them off my taming pin. But yeah. you can bowl with these guys too. Okay. Well, but they do like a, a, a bleed and they uh, slow you down. Okay. Um, do you want to pull those guys away so I can grab that artifact? Yeah. Ascendant Rex saddle and I think a Dunk Leo saddle. Trying to get on that vampire here. Um, do we need to call these guys back? Because we don't want to kill your 150. The way the levels are on here, like if we kill them, we'll be alright. Okay. I'm at 1140. If we were like playing Aberration map, I would say, yeah, you want food. Because they walk like. They can do the tight rope walk on aberration. I like if you, need, if you need gems. That one's just level 25. Dead now. You see that little bird? Oh yeah, around? what's what's that bird? So there's um there's the, there's like a shine horn, there's the feather lights, and there's another one. It's basically like a lamp that sits on your shoulder. Okay. So when you're on aberration you'll want those if you're out like in the dark area to keep the nameless from spawning. And you want to take one in the boss fight too. A nameless Venom? I just got nameless Venom. What does that do? I'm trying to remember what it makes. It's You need it to tame rock drakes. Oh, okay. And I think it heals the rock drakes too. Oh, yeah, it says volatile substance that can be used to raise rock tricks. Gotcha. So, like, when you do the aberration boss, you you take your rock tricks in with you. Uh-huh. And you use those for, like, the heal potions. I like the, um... The veggie cakes for... Like the non carnivores. What's that little um, lamb looking thing down there with the shiny head? It's one of the uh, the light sources. Oh, okay. So They're all a passive tame. Is this the end of the cave? 
No, you you turned around. You came back to where we started. Oh, okay. Where do we go? See where I'm at? Yeah. Those little firefly thingies, are those, do those give you anything good? No, I think they're just, uh... Decoration? Yeah. Like, if you need, like, red, green, or blue gems to build anything, this is where you gotta get them. Oh, I see, okay. So those are gems down there, not crystals? Or both? Yeah, the red ones are red gems. There's uh, blue gems and green gems. Okay. So this is one of those crab things you were talking about, right? Yeah. They will grab your mount and you. So you gotta be careful. They, uh, can you tame those? Yeah. Carcinus. Oh, there's you a need... summoning platform in here. Okay. You need a, uh... Yeah, there's like a big catapult you gotta make. Oh, right, okay. Then lure it in. Yeah. What is this terminal? Oh, this is Megapithecus. Well, Megapithecus is an island boss, though. Yeah, but, like, if you go to one of the obelisk outside... Yeah? It's... it's different bosses. There's a yellow artifact container in here if you want to grab it. I don't know what that means. Whatever it is, it's attacking me. Oh, Seekers. So Seekers come out during the day, I think. Uh-huh. And Nameless come out at night. Oh, Got an Ascendant Saber Tooth battle. What the hell was that? Oh, Perlovia. And a Megaloth. Looks like they killed him. These guys are bastards. I haven't been farther than this. Because when I came in, I was on foot. Oh, okay. Watch out for radiation. I don't know if they added it in or not. Oh, there's radiation zones? In aberration there are, that's what the hazmat suits. I think this then weren't we already here? Did we get turned around? Or did we go around in a circle? No, this is just it's just going deeper. It's just another charge station. You sure? This looks very familiar. 
I think we went around in a circle, dude. Maybe it circled around. I think it did. Oh, yeah, I guess it just circled around. So, okay, so that's the cave then. Nice. Explains why I needed a grapple hook to get out when I didn't need one to go in. <laughs> yep. But there's glow sticks and on aberration. It's just, this is a charge station for like glow sticks and stuff. There's a 140 Ravager. Let me double check. I think I, I can't remember if I have a male or a female. I'm gonna run over and look real quick. It's a level 25, yeah. What are all those there's like these gem things on the ground. Does the rat drop those? Yeah, if you pick them up, the roll rat will attack you. Oh, okay. Well, he did anyway. Oh, the gems disappeared. What? That's funny. I just realized there's a cave here. I didn't even know that. It's a pretty small cave. Whoa. It tried to load it, load us in. Yeah, that cave does not look like uh, one we can take the bat through, so... We'll have to explore that some other time. All right, it is night time, so let's turn on night vision. Um, incidentally, oh wow, we can we can see under the water really good with this too. Check that out. That's cool. Um, I was what was I gonna say? Oh, so yeah, I've. Uh, there, there's there's a lot of stuff that this team can do because I, I kind of I looked it up after the last episode. Um, one of them, of course, being night vision. Um, if I hold down the R key, I can turn on um, life steal. And what that'll do is I can then pick up a small animal, and the bat will start to essentially suck its blood and uh, build up its quantity of blood bags. And you know, eventually kill the animal if I if I don't let it go before all all of its blood's gone. Uh, so we can do that. It does have a, a glide mechanic similar to the Griffins, but it's not uh, it's not as good. It's okay, but it's not as good. Uh, so it's got all that. Um, and I also found out, and, and some of you guys may have mentioned this to me in the uh, in the comments, but I haven't seen those comments yet um, since the video from yesterday. Uh, but it also, I, I found out the way to tame it and get a max efficiency tame is that you have to bring other critters with you and let the the bat essentially feed off those critters until its taming um, level reaches 100%, and then you let it grab you like you normally would. So uh, if and when we tame another one of these later on, uh, I'll know I'll know how to do it properly. So anyway. Yeah, very useful creature. I've got a, I got its health up to a thousand, or no, sorry, ten thousand. Damage is at fifteen thousand, and then I've been pumping melee damage. I'll probably get that to a thousand, and then put the rest in speed. Uh, but it's it's also a very, a pretty fast, uh, flying creature too. It's faster than than even my Argent with some of the Argent's speed built up. So, yeah, it's not not bad. Uh, let's see, while we're going through here, 
there this little section yeah this little sec whoops uh, right through here I haven't actually uncovered on the map so but it looks like it's just kind of a combination what is all that I don't know what those little star things are that was weird uh, a combination of the snow and aut autumn biome Okay, we are back to the cave that has the artifact of the hunter. Uh, we did very briefly come in here when we did our map tour, but we didn't go any further than this because that's a, a deep, dark hole. Um, so what we're going to do is we want to make sure that you are following us, but we'll keep you on passive for the time being. And uh, there is water down at the bottom of the hole uh, but there's also supposed to be a place that we can fly through I need some light there we go oh it looks like there's piranha or something in the water okay let's stop for a second there's a artifact thing there oh Wait, I thought that water was shallow. Yeah, there's definitely um, some piranha in here. Oh, yeah, it is shallow, but okay. Uh, I did, as you can see, uh, find a lamp for my shotgun. Okay, let's do this. Let's get back on Vampira and put this away. What are you? Oh, she's latched. I'm going, what the hell's going on? No, 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 no. Don't latch. Just land. She keeps wanting to latch. Oh, it's because I'm so close to the ceiling. That's why. Okay. Well, I want I wanted her to walk. Okay. Well, whatever. She can just hover while we go through here. All right. What do we got? Blueprint for a journeyman cloth and a nice uh, fur chest piece. We'll take that. Okay. Look at these skeletons, man. That's cool. So I think we have to break through here. All right, let's go. Come on, Vampira. Vampira. Oh, nice. We got another loot crate there. All right, we do have some bad guys down here. I think I prefer to be mounted on her. Oh, there's some uh, Megasaurus thingamadoodles down there. Okay, we'll kill this onk. Let's see if we can pull. What level are these guys, by the way? A 55 and a 60. Okay. Yeah, let's see if we can pull some of the onks over here. I'm sure it would be fine if we try took them all on at the same time, but let's make not make it difficult. Going after that's a one ten. Okay. 
Try this again. Didn't quite connect. Oh, we got two coming now. Okay, let's get on. Keep forgetting I can back up and strafe. Makes this job a lot easier. Okay. Thought I saw maybe one more onk over here, but maybe not. Let's see what we get. Gotta reload. Oh, look at that. There's our improved long neck rifle. Beautiful. And uh, we also got a, an ascendant fur chest piece. That's some good loot. Okay, let's um switch these guys out. Put the scope on him. Really good loot. Fantastic. So this long neck basically does twice, over twice the damage as the the normal one. Too bad it wasn't a blueprint, but I'll take it anyway. Not going to complain about that. Um, Just trying to decide if I want to kill those megalosaurs or not. We could probably leave them alone. They only wake up at nighttime, so as long as we don't actually attack them, I don't, I, I don't think they'll bother us. Okay, let's go. We gotta do a deep dive down into an underground cavern. This reminds me of um, the center. We might as well grab that because I, I actually have been grabbing those recently, just to get myself leveled up as and. As well as the Desmodius. Or Desmodus. Desmodus? Modus? Okay, let's yeah, let's just keep pumping her melee until we get her to, to a thousand and then any points that we have left we'll put into movement speed. Yeah, that is that is really nice. Let's get rid of this. I'm gonna actually put that stuff on the Desmodus. Okay. There's more onk. And there is the artifact of the hunter. What? What are you doing? Just land. just came back instantly it does that but usually you can p get it once or twice and then you have to wait for a bit all right it looks like some big piranha fish down in that water i wonder how deep that water is it looks like a giant clam or something um I don't know, can we put this on in here? Oh yeah, we can, cool. This gives us an, at least an idea of how deep it is. It does go down there a ways. That is really useful. Oh, what the hell is that? Is that a Mosasaur? Yep, I think that's a Mosasaur. Or wait, no. Can I see that from here? Oh, it's a Sarko. Okay. It's just a Sarko. 
Alright, well, I don't see any compelling reason to, to go down there. If there was like a, um, an artifact chest or something, or a loot crate. This, this mount is, oh, there is one down there, actually. All right. Um, we did bring Lazarus Chatter. I didn't bring any flippers with me, though. Yeah, but there is a chest down there, dire directly below me. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I should have brought some flippers, damn it. Let's put you down here. Okay, yeah, you stay on passive. We could get the piranhas to come like that. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, man. This uh this might be a little more than I bargained for. We managed to kill one of them. Let's see if I can get far enough in the water to lure them back here again. Okay, we got you. That one. Yeah, as soon as they knock me off, then I can't shoot in the water. These bastards are tough. Super piranhas. Here, let's... um. Let's just take these, because these two in particular will help with health regen and stamina regen. Nice. Whoa. Sarko came out of the water. Okay, well, we don't have to deal with him now. already dead. Okay, here comes another one. Yeah, there goes our armor. Come on, let me get up here. Okay, here he comes. Gotcha, sucker. <laughs> Uh, 200 seconds on Lazarus Chowder, and of course we can always have more later if we need to. So let's do this. Oh, man, that guy scares me. Where did you guys come from? thought you were all dead. Um, let's get back up and get some air real quick. I think we said it was this one here, right? Yeah, pretty sure. Well, if I come down here again, I'll definitely bring the scuba gear. Okay, yeah, I see the crate. Get full air. Okay, here we go. We got a, a rune down here we can grab too. We'll get the crate first though, that's the important thing. Where are you? Leave me alone. Oh nice, it's a red crate too. Okay, well there's some scuba leggings. Doesn't suck. Get this rune. And head on back up. Yeah. 
There we go. Two, level 290. <laughs> Jeez. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I think uh, our work here is done. Um, oh, you still got night vision on. I don't think we need to keep that on. Oh, yeah, by the way, the... Uh, there we go. If you just tap the left mouse button, uh, he does a... Or she, rather, does a, a sweep of the wing. Oh, look! There's more to, more cave here. Is this like a, a, a different way out? Oh, wow. Okay. That's a lot of badness. Nice. Boy, it would be uh, quite the challenge to have to get out of here on foot. Okay, let's give you some more melee damage points. Look at all that spoiled meat. My goodness, we're getting heavy. I'm going to chuck the arrows. Of course, the berries. We don't need those. Could we actually see better if we put night vision on? Let's see. Actually, yeah, I think we can. Just a touch. Man, how far back does this cave go? Oh, is this a dead end? Oh, it's a dead end. Oh, shoot. I thought it was a like a way out. Unless... Oh, well, wait a minute, though. Can we just break like the wall to get out let's see aha uh -huh. look at this okay mm This way. Ah, here we go. We see sunlight. And this is how we get out. Very cool. See, I didn't know that. I didn't know you. There was a a back exit. I thought you had to go back the way you came. All right, let's turn this off. Right out over the edge of the ocean. That was fun. I really enjoyed that cave. All right, you guys. Well, um, we are like super heavy. We don't need this. Uh, yeah, we don't need that. Don't need that. Uh, um, so not sure what we're going to do in the next episode. We'll figure it out though. And, uh, I want to, I, I, I want to keep looking for another 150 uh, mail wrecks so you know we're continuing to keep our eye open for that we want to get a 150 uteranus and therizinosaur i mean at least assuming you know that we're going to put together the same kind of army that we would like on the island i don't see why not because um i think all the bosses the main bosses anyways on this map are the island bosses i know megapithecus was inside of the Aberration Cave and the dragon is inside of the cave down in the southwest. So, yeah. Um, very cool. All right, guys. I'm going to let you go here. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video, and we'll catch you all in the next episode. Say goodbye, Vampira. That was goodbye.